folks, how you doing today? So this just came out of service in detail. This is a 1934 exhibit supply company personality indicator. These were extremely popular back in the 30s and 40s in arcades. And you know, it's, it's a personality indicator. It's kind of a spoof, it's kind of fun. Uh, so we went completely through this one. This is ran on battery as the majority of them were back in the day. Some people do conversions as we have and put converters in there, which is not a bad thing. This one just happens to still be on batteries. So I'll show you how it works. Now, mind you, this is 84 years old, right? It's cool, it's got great graphics. So, okay, so what did I, if I, if you walked up here right now, uh, I'm a dumbbell, okay? Now I'm cautious. Now I'm adorable. So this, this is, is Walker, this is Walker. He's adorable too. This is the same program that the uh, Mexican authorities use on who's going to be uh, who's going to be searched and who's not. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, okay. not. I just want to make sure. So uh, as you see here, it has a patent date of 1934 on it. This is exhibit supply company. These basically came in quite a few different models. I think right now online we also have a triple of these, which is three of them. Here's a singular one, battery operated, 1934 plays on a penny, service detail. These are great little machines, just as artwork. I mean, even if it didn't run, it's just a cool looking machine. However, this got brand new light bulbs in it, got brand new batteries. We have indicated on the batteries, which you will see in the stills, how to connect it, okay? Just a great little 30s game, countertop, penny arcade, light up, cool little game. Uh, if you got kids, when you have parties, there are, uh, these would be a real lot of fun for the kids to play. Anyway, great little uh, arcade trade stimulator. Yeah, what I like about a unit like this, it's just an easy play. So you could have this sitting in your room and anybody with a penny could just uh, pull it and go and get some kind of results versus some of the other games that require all kinds of skill.